There's going to be four rounds of the junior middleweight division. Coming to the ring, in the blue corner, Duran Hester! Just ropes up to that guy's shoulders and get to your body step over. I'm telling you. Rice, the golden boy, Mills. Now, this Mills is the real deal. Scooch. He's a very talented boxer, uh, has a great fan base, young. This guy's going to go some places. Uh, yeah, yeah, he's very impressive. I see I seen him getting in there and uh, handling business pretty quickly tonight. Yeah, I think he's going to handle business uh, Chris pretty fast. I don't disagree with you at all. Uh, his last couple of fights have been um, – where well, his last fight was with the Xavier Martinez. That was, that was a great a, fight. Yeah, yeah, that was a great fight. Unanimous decision on that one. He got pushed a little bit. But the ones before that, he's just busy about the hands, knocking people out. So Yeah. Um, yeah, Xavier, here, Xavier Martinez is a talented fighter, had a good amateur career. Uh, just recently lost a fight, unfortunately. Um but I've met the guy. He's a, he's a good guy. He's got yeah. his head in the right place, and I hope him all the best. But here we go. In the blue Rice corner, Mills, Darren Hester. 52 pounds with red trunks and white stripes. He's a veteran of seven pro fights from Wilson, North Carolina. Give it up for Deron Hester. In the red corner, weighing in at 154 pounds. He's wearing black trunks with white stripes. He's 4 and 0 with two knockouts from Syracuse, New York. Price, the Golden Boy, Mills! Right before this fight starts, I got a bunch of my friends and buddies from my workplace coming by and saying hey and throwing me a couple of fist bumps and a lot of love. It's good to see a bunch of familiar faces coming out to support uh, uh, our buddy, uh, you know, Mike Engler, later on and uh, some of the local fighters. I can't so, wait. Here we go. Here we go. Round one. Look how methodical Bryce is with his hands down low. He's, he's just very, very methodical. Yeah, he's trying to see what this guy wants to do. Oh, yeah. gosh. Okay. Ooh, that was a lot of heat on that one. All uh, right, hey, al already, Chris. Looks like what he delivered a body shot, and Hester's already down for the standing eight. Yeah, I think he was a little off balance too. He had his yeah. weight. He was kind of had his weight on him. So, what? Oh my God! Wow. Well, just like that, but well, what the right to the body, and Hester doesn't want to continue. That's it. Yeah, that's a little disappointing. I'm not gonna lie. Wow. Wouldn't you imagine? I'm yeah, let's see this replay. Let's see this replay. He's just waiting to size him up. Look like he took, a, he took a couple shots. Yeah, oh, that was that, a, that it was, was that a, body shot. Yeah, that, that was a pretty shot. brutal shot. Yep. That was a pretty brutal one. That body shot he hated. And I, I would assume the ref that looked him. That looked fast on the slow replay. So. Yeah. Slow-mo, that looked like a hard shot still as fast. All right. I'll give it to him. That was a good shot. He still should have kept going, but. You know, you can't win them all. That looked tough. Yeah, that looked like a hard shot. See, now, it's easy for me to say he should have kept going, and I don't disagree with you because I'm kind of hard-headed, but I didn't get hit by the guy. That's you know, true. So maybe his insides were so shook up, he was like, I don't even know where I'm at right now, so yeah. maybe I better just quit. <laughs> yeah, you're right about that. <laughs> well, I'll tell you what, Mike. With 37 seconds into the first round, your winner by TKO, Bryce. The Golden Boy Mills! 